Hello my beautiful Sagittarius and welcome to your general reading. We're going to see what is coming towards you, family, lover, friend or foe. Please remember the energies in the readings can go vice versa, so only take what resonates, which agendas. Switch your roles, do what you have to do and leave the rest. If any of you would like to book a personal reading or to purchase anything, all the information is in the description box below. So my beautiful Sagittarius, let's see what is coming to... Ooh coming towards you okay all these cards flew out but we'll take this one okay beautiful it says the thick and healthy good news good health and expansion beautiful energy this is your this card was inspired by your energy Sagittarius okay because you will expansion and then we have the length check which says progression reaping what you sow and development beautiful energy okay so for some of you there could be something that you have been working on for a while you're about to see some changes okay you're going to see some healthy growth this could actually be your hair maybe you're putting products in your hair you know you know, like when you blow dry it and then it's all the way down your back it's like oh my goodness yes i can i can see the fucking progression yes honey yes okay but for others of you i feel like it's something that you have been building on you've been working on i feel like you're really sagging right now I got that in your last reading, like, you know, this is your season, Sagittarius, so I feel like you're, like, optimizing your energy to its fullest capacity, and that is beautiful energy, okay? If you're worried about your health, there's no need to worry about anything, okay? I'm just getting, like, you're just going to be getting good news, with, like, with whatever it is that you've been working on, or just, I don't know, whatever you've been wishing for, or hoping for, or praying for, boom, or you're seeing the results yourself. You're seeing the fucking results and you're just like, yes, okay? Yes. So beautiful energy. Beautiful. You know, you just don't even want to, don't even want to clarify, okay? Gorgeous. So something is progressing, Sagittarius. Okay, this could be a business. This could be anything. I don't know what it is. It's going to be different for different people. But I just feel like you're seeing the progress. You're reaping what you sown. Whatever you sown, it was good. It was good, Okay. So beautiful energy. So expect some positive news, Sagittarius. Okay. So what do we have? Okay, so we have the title that wanted to come out. And then we have the big chop at the bottom of the deck. So for some of you, you could have decided to kind of start something brand new and you're already seeing the results. Okay. Or maybe that's what you're thinking about. Like, should I start something new? Is it going to take long? It's going to progress. You're going to see the development. Okay. Because maybe that's what you're wondering. You're wondering, you know what? I don't want to start all over again because something's going to take long. I feel like something is going to... Um, I'm hearing be better this time. If you cut your hair off, I feel like it's going to grow back thicker and healthier. Okay? For some of you as well, this could be like a business or like a channel or something that you're trying to title. This could be a book maybe that you're writing. But I feel like you're trying to figure out the title, like what you want to name something. Okay? You're just not too sure. Okay? You want to name something where you know it's going to attract a lot of attention. Okay, for some of you, this could be like a baby as well. Maybe, you know, you're counting down the months and you're thinking, okay, I haven't thought of a name yet. What name do I want? Okay, this could be pertaining to so many different things. For some of you, this could be a relationship as well. Maybe your relationship is moving. Um, you know, it's starting to progress. You're starting to develop feelings. And you're just like, okay, so what are we? Are we together? Or are we not? Am I your boyfriend? Am I your girlfriend? Like, what's going on? I don't understand why people don't ask you to be their girlfriend these days. You know what I mean? Like, people really just be telling you. Um, like, one day you're just talking to someone. They just refer to you as their girlfriend. It's like, okay, excuse me. You know? Or, like, somebody will just be like, okay, well, what about if we get married? And then if we get married and it doesn't work out, you're just like, okay, wait, wait. <laughs> wait what <laughs> you know what i mean nobody gets down on one knee anymore or just you know what i mean it's just like okay we're together like so when did you ask me okay so maybe you're just trying to figure something out like what's really going on like things are going a bit fast but like you know it's just i mean hold on slow down darling slow down but underneath that oh we got the goddess so somebody definitely feels like you know you are um they're of a half if this is a relationship we have the goddess and the demigod okay so beautiful energy. But, you know, she's a full goddess. He's a demigod. So he's half god. So somebody knows, you know, the divine feminine energy holds more weight. But we're not going to go there today, guys. Because, you know, people are not ready for that conversation. They're not ready for that conversation. But anyway, let's move on. Let's move on. Okay. So beautiful energy.
Okay, so we have self-love that wanted to come out. Sorry, my top feels like... Okay, sorry guys. We have self-love. It says, all that love you've been dishing out to yourself, save some save some for yourself sorry and then we have surprise at the bottom of the deck which reads expect the unexpected yeah i feel like you're not expecting something to blow up or you're not expecting to hear good news you know you're just not expecting something but you're going to be pleasantly surprised about the outcome or something okay i feel like you are focusing on yourself as well maybe it's this is why something is working because you have self-love you have self-value therefore you can love and put value into other things okay so this is really beautiful for some of you you could be deciding to free yourself from somebody as well you're just like you know what? i don't want to have no titles i want to have nothing maybe you feel like you expand better when you're single or when you're by yourself you know what I mean? Maybe you feel like you progress better. Or maybe as soon as you cut someone off, something just starts picking up. And you're just like, yeah, I knew you were the fucking problem. Okay. <laughs> like I said, it could be going many different ways for different people. Okay. So let's just see. This is for my beautiful Sagittarius. Please clarify the thick and healthy. What do we have? Oof, oof, oof. Yes, honey. We have the goddess of wands. Here you are. Gorgeous. And then here you are. Temperance. You are really up in your energy today, Sag. You are looking fine and divine and feisty and sexy. Okay. So gorgeous energy. This could be your um your looks are expanding. You know what I mean? You know, sometimes you just don't feel, you know, like you look that good, but you like, like everybody's like, no, you're gorgeous. You're just like, really? Okay, well, you know, I didn't even know, but thank you. Well, I'm sure you do, but you know. <laughs> okay, but I feel like you're just feeling balanced. Okay, some of you as well, maybe you're um You've tempered your energy so well that you have mastered patience. Because, you know, I know that Sagittarius are not very patient signs. However, you know, you rule the temperance card. And that's a very balanced, patient, divine timing type of energy. So I feel like maybe that's something that you've worked on with the development card. You're like learning to kind of ground yourself. And then you're realizing that the more you ground yourself, the quicker things come to you. Okay, but either way, I'm just getting somebody who's very powerful and very magical and very, very attractive right now man or woman watching this so beautiful energy okay because yeah we got the goddess of one so we got the word goddess here twice so somebody's vibrating extremely high right now oh this is how somebody views you okay whoa i can feel the heat people honestly oh god I'm also getting it's that self-love. I feel like people find it really attractive. There could be somebody figuring out whether or not they want to approach you as well. You know, like, oh, that with the title, somebody's trying to work out, like, are you single? Are you, like, you know, what's your what's your situation? So my situation is me, darling. Okay, that's why I stay fine and divine because I ain't got no motherfucker stressing me the fuck out. <laughs> hey, someone's like, I won't stress you out. I'll prove it to you with the page of pentacles. <laughs> But yeah, for some of you, you definitely could be trying to figure out the title of something. Or maybe you're trying to find some kind of document or some type of proof. Or you're waiting for some kind of money to come in. Like I said, you're not expecting something. I think it's like a check. Or some type of finance is coming in that you're not expecting. Or maybe somebody's going to give you something. The Eight of Cups. It could be somebody that you walked away from. Or somebody may want you to let something go. And they're giving you something as like some kind of peace offering. I feel like somebody wants to surprise you. You know, they want to start over with the big chop energy. Okay. And then, yeah, we have the turn of swords. Second time that's came out. Yeah. So I feel like, you know, maybe you've just been backstabbed, hurt and betrayed by too many people. You're just like, you know what? When I'm to myself, I'm focusing on myself. I'm doing things on myself. Me look good, me feel good. And everything in my life stays good. Okay. And that's what it is. Could be dealing with a Gemini, Capricorn, Virgo. Taurus or another Sagittarius Leo or an Aries but you know what I mean I feel like no more pain no more hurt no more betrayals if anybody disrespects you or hurts you it's like boom goodbye big chop I'm off okay goddess treatment only or god treatment only if you are a god out here if you're a man watching this video okay and then we have the five of pentacles. Yeah, just leaving people bitter and out in the cold or bent up and sad up. You just don't business. You know, business, okay? Could be dealing with a Taurus. Okay, you've taken the heat and you've taken the fire. You know what I mean? People are out here in the cold, pain, hurt. You just don't give a fuck. I feel like as well, somebody's surprised at your like, um, 
not your get back game, but somebody is could be shocked at how like your ability to just move on. It's like, do you do you not know I'm a Sagittarius? Free spirit, like I'm not attached, I'm all in the sky and in the clouds doing other things. Okay, someone just doesn't understand your energy, Sag. I also feel like it hurts to see for people to see you like looking this good or having all this fire. Like it's just it's just burning people out here. You're burning people with your flames. You know what I mean? Honestly. But yeah, with the five of pentacles, I don't know. I feel like someone's just kind of feeling kind of cold right now. Like I said, something could be expanding in your life and someone can see that and they just... Maybe somebody was surprised as well. Maybe somebody didn't think that you were going to do well or that you didn't want to... You wasn't going to get something that was owed to you or something like that. But I feel like something is coming to you with the title and the page of pentacles. I just heard something about court as well. Maybe you're owed money or something like that. Somebody could have betrayed you, lied to you, stole from you, something. I don't know what's happening here, but with the five of pentacles, you know, I just feel like you make people feel insecure because this is a card of insecurity. And look how powerful and sexy and gorgeous she is in this card. Look how much fire there is there. And this person looks all crock up at the end of the call. So I feel like someone feels all cold without you and you're just like, well, I don't know what to tell you. Or maybe people are bitter because of your newfound success, confidence, glow up energy. Yeah, you need to have more fun. I feel like some of you are having fun and you're enjoying your life and you need to accept help. Yeah, I feel like somebody wants your help or they need your energy. And you're just like, well, oh, well, because maybe you have the good ideas, you know, you rule luck and expansion. So I feel like your energy um, it helps other people to expand, but maybe people take advantage of that. So you're just like, you know what, may I got take my good energy away from you and you can stay here with your insecure self. Okay. <laughs> well, thank you so much. I hope it resonated for you guys. Please don't hesitate to like, share, comment and subscribe.